What's up guys? I hope you're all staying safe and remembering to social distance. I know there's a lot of somber news going on right now with the coronavirus spreading, people losing their jobs, and just overall craziness happening in the world. But in times like these, it's more important than ever to stay positive and focus on the good. Just from talking to a lot of my friends and family and uh, seeing people's posts, I understand a lot of people are starting to feel anxious and trapped inside their homes right now and overly cautious about doing things that we took for granted like going to the grocery store out of fear of catching it. I even find myself avoiding people like the plague whenever I, whenever I have to go get food. But it's more important than ever to maintain a positive outlook and think of this as an opportunity to really focus on yourself and coming out of this a much better person than you were going into it. Write that novel that you've been thinking about doing, learn a new skill, clean out your home, build better relationships with the people who are closest to you, whether they're in your house with you or you have to talk to them, talk to them through video chatting services. There are so many and there's no excuse not to be able to communicate with your loved ones. Overall, just come out of this a much better person than you were going into it. But that's not to say you should feel down and out on yourself if you aren't doing things within the category of productivity. We go through a lot of things in our daily lives and a lot of them are stressful, whether it be work, obligations that you have to be accountable for in your day-to-day -day lives, or just dealing with people in general. These are all very stressful things for a lot of people and it's okay to take this time to just rest and relax and reset your batteries because this isn't going to last forever. Some of the things that I've been doing since this all started is just focusing on coding, becoming a better programmer than I was, um, finishing up projects that I virtually had no time to do before because I tend to take on a lot more than I probably should as far as work goes. And um, I've been also, um, beating a lot of my uh, video game backlog where if you don't know what that is that's just a library of games that you have that you haven't had time to play yet so um, I just beat Borderlands 3 which was a great game it kind of dragged on as far as like getting to the finish and ending but overall it was a fun enjoyable ride and uh, right now I'm playing Persona 5, Animal Crossing New Horizons and The Witcher 3 all of which have been incredible um, you're probably gonna see a lot more video game videos because now that I have more time I don't have anything to do because <laughs> everything's closed so I'm going to be making a lot of um, let's plays and like uh, video game videos for you guys to watch so stay tuned for that um, I've been writing more because uh, I just have so many ideas um, that flow through my head at any given time whether it be stories uh, thoughts or just like things on my mind and sometimes it's better to get that stuff on paper rather than letting it circulate in your head that can kind of drive you crazy. I know it does. So if that's something, if that's a problem that you have, that's a good thing to do. Um, it's helped me and it just kind of helps you stay clear and focused. But my whole point is to not wallow in the negativity and really focus on the positive and changing your perception to that because this isn't going to last forever. There will be brighter days out and we will get through this. And to all the wonderful, wonderful people out there putting their lives on the line, helping people who are dealing with this virus, thank you. You guys are doing great despite the lack of resources and I really hope um, everything comes through for you soon. I know it's stressful and I know it's hard. I, I just hope it gets better. And um, that's it for now. I hope you all stay tuned for more. Stay odd and I'll see you guys later.